Today we're going to uh, show you how to operate the uh, Thermax CT3. These are very uh, well constructed machines. You can remove this lid and uh, take a bucket and fill this stainless steel tank with uh, three gallons of hot water. We recommend that you put your steam detergent in first. Uh, the product we recommend is called Exterminator. You use uh, two ounces to one gallon of water. It's in powder form. It dilutes very easily in the hot water. It's, it's uh, very economical. Uh, replace the lid, unwrap the cord, plug it in, and turn the switch on. When you turn that switch on, it activates the pump and the heating element. The pump will run for just a moment and shuts off. It's a demand pump. It'll only uh, run when you demand water. If you're using the uh, power brush, you hook the power brush here, and here's the brush. Very well designed uh, piece of equipment. And when you turn the vacuum switch on, it also sends power to your brush. So your brush does not have an on off switch. You turn the brush on and off uh, by the vacuum. Now as far as the hoses are concerned, they're very simple. The big hose goes here, and the other end of the hose goes on the wash. The same with the solution hose. You lock it in place here and then you attach it uh, to the end of your uh, floor tool. When you're done cleaning, remove the lid. This, water, this bucket now holds the dirty water. You pour it uh, down the sink or toilet, set it back in place, replace the lid, and you're ready to start over again. If by chance you find water leaking out the bottom of the machine, what that means is that you have foam developed in your bucket and now it's going in your vac motor and is spitting out the machine. If that happens, remove the bucket, empty it, rinse it out. Before you place the bucket back on, turn the vacuum on and just let some air blow through it and it'll dry it right out. I hope you found this instructive, uh, this video instructive. Uh, please uh, visit us at our website, www.carpetexpress.biz. Thanks for watching.